Hello, it's me, Pladly. Yes, my real name. Don't look it up. I respect women! It is 4 in the morning, and I just finished watching both Infinity War and Endgame, two great films that cap off 10 years of amazing, awesome superhero movies. The Marvel movies are full of awesome, relatable heroes and some epic moments. There are certainly some epic moments in Avengers Endgame. Damn! So today, let's go over the top 10 epicest moments from Avengers Endgame. Number 10. Captain Marvel being a jerk to my favorite characters. Everyone loved Captain Marvel. Everyone. It was a great film that showed a relatable character who really conveyed real human emotions. It was truly incredible. So when I found out Captain Marvel would be in this movie, I was through the roof. I mean, really, you have no idea how excited I was. Anyways, I never really liked any of the characters in the Marvel movies. They were all just too... flat and boring. Like Iron Man, a rich man who was captured by terrorists to manufacture weapons, only to instead build a robot suit and escape with his life, turning from a life of being a massive jerk face to a caring guy who wants to protect everyone. That's pretty boring, am I right? Ant-Man, a lovable thief and loving father who turns from his life of crime to become a superhero and help people. Yod! Now look at Captain Marvel! She's a strong woman with no flaws except that she's too powerful, of course. So, what I really enjoyed seeing from this movie is how she just kind of rolls her eyes at all the stupid characters I've been watching for 10 years and acts like they're all idiots. It was truly incredible. Number 9. Blockbuster and Captain Marvel. Okay, so technically this wasn't in Endgame, but I just had to include this on the list. You see, in the great film Captain Marvel, she crashes into a blockbuster. I get it. Do you get it? Blockbuster is something I remember from the olden days, before they made a stupid Avengers movie. I mean, who even cares about the Avengers when Captain Marvel exists? <sighs> I tell ya, I really hope that Captain Marvel won all the Oscars. Number 8. Thor is fat. I was watching Endgame and Thor was fat. That was funny, cause he wasn't fat before, but now he is. So funny, definitely the best part of the movie. Number 7. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and before we get back to counting down the top 10 diseases that have killed millions of people, we're coming at you with number 7, the mouse scene. There's a rat, and it steps on a, the button. I laughed very hard cause rat. Number 5. Korg and Meek are in this movie. They were in Thor Ragnarok, and I thought they were funny- OH FORTNITE! WAS THAT FORTNITE?! Fortnite. Fortnite is epic. This scene is truly incredible. Number 3. The women's scene. Alright guys, I want to get real for a moment. It makes me so mad that women have no rights at all. I mean, it's appalling. Women can't vote. Women can't drive. Women can't even get health care. It is truly sad. But then, the writers of the movie stepped in and said, Not today, men. This is all for you, my lady. So basically, they have to get the glove thing over there, but there's monsters. Oh no, what are we gonna do when there's all these men around? Well, the women finally step out of the kitchen. They ain't making no mo sandwiches. They are all just standing around in kind of the same area, and they are gathered now and... Wait, so, like, they were all just kind of, like, standing around? I guess, like, weren't they in a bunch of other spots? Also, wait, how did Wasp get over there? Wasn't she just helping Ant-Man over at the van, which is the same place they're trying to get the gauntlet? Couldn't Wasp just grab the gauntlet and shrink it down and fly it over there real quick? Also, where are the men during this part? Like, they're obviously not fighting any of the monsters, because that's what the women are doing. Are the men just, like, standing there watching? What are the odds of all the women being in the same spot? Also, none of them got hit when Thanos' ship rained fire on the ground? Couldn't one of the other magic -y guys, like Wong or one of the thousands of magic -y guys, just kind of teleport the gauntlet so they wouldn't have to go through all those monsters? Number 2. Captain Marvel is truly a strong, powerful warrior. She has proven in this movie that she is strong, and most importantly powerful, not to mention she is a warrior. Thanos is little baby compared to her, and she kills him and- <laughs> <laughs> okay, actually, I take that all back. That was actually pretty funny to watch. Let me rewind that scene. <laughs> oh, she got punched by Thanos. That was very epic. Number one. Damn. So that was the top 10 epicest moments in Avengers Endgame. Thank you so much for watching, and 
Is anyone else really excited for Endgame 2? I mean, what was up with that cliffhanger? What's gonna happen to Cap? 